All right, man, you be safe tonight. Why are you looking all good? Where are you, where are you coming from? Uh, Long Beach. Long Beach? Long Beach? Is that where you work? Is that where you work? No, I work in the Yeah? You look good, my friend. <laughs> That's so cool. Well, Mary, man. That's really cool. <laughs> 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 Done. Just spent three hours with your fans. Yeah. They're still chanting your name out there. Yeah. What's that been like, man? Man, that's that's really cool. It's amazing, man. I uh, I'm just extremely grateful for all the support. I mean, it means a lot. And uh, I mean what fuel you know to continue to fight and continue striving on to do things better and just ultimately make all these people proud again so um you know i'm definitely inspired and motivated tonight to you know to just finish this thing in an extraordinary way not only for myself but for all these people and uh yeah it's great i i saw it just came to my mind you getting face to face a lot of face offs with the fans stuff yeah. like that and it made me think Who's had the worst breath that you've fought? Uh, <laughs> the worst breath? Oh, man. You know, I, I can't recall anyone having bad breath. Yeah. <laughs> no, I no, for sure you go D.C. Just <laughs> no, nah, yeah, huh. it, it smells like fried chicken. Yeah, you're right. uh, right. Do you think the division has cut up to your talent? The division has caught up? Uh, um, that, that's hard to say. That's hard to say. Um, my last fight wasn't the most entertaining, so it's kind of hard to say where I am, uh, where I stack up against the division. I'm still the youngest light heavyweight in the division. I believe I'm still the best in the world, and uh, and uh, you know I'm, I'm excited to get back out there and prove that. Speaking of division catching up, Ronda, it seems that seems to be the case with Ronda Rousey is that yeah. the division just got better and and you know she's kind of they're all at that level right now yeah. is, is that what you you would yeah well, with Rhonda I feel as if um, I feel like she's <laughs> I, I feel like with uh, that's funny <laughs> I feel like with Ronda, um, she's great at, at grappling, and she's great at you know, um, you know her throws and everything. Um, but her striking has hasn't quite elevated to the level it needs to be at to compete at the highest level. So, um, so yeah, I, I think she has a bright future ahead of her. I think she still wins against the majority of the division. I think she needs to just do the extra in that striking category to be able to compete when she's not able to take people down to the ground. Uh, Holly Holm uh, is fighting for the championship in a division higher, but she's been very vocal, but she can still come back down to, to 35. Yeah, yeah, Holly um, could easily make 35. Do you see her being kind of the biggest challenger to Amanda, do you think? Um, it's hard to say. Um, it's hard to say. You know, Amanda Nunes is looking, she's looking phenomenal and very well-rounded, and, and it's hard to be the champion who, who has, you know, small holes in their game. Um, it's hard to say. Like I, I haven't seen uh, Amanda show too many weaknesses, so it's kind of hard to bet against her at this point. What do you think about Dylan Dallin? Dylan calling you out. Uh, uh, yeah, um, you know, with him, uh, you know, he's a lot smaller than me, so already going into that grappling match, there's not much to gain. Um, I just beat Henderson, and I was a lot bigger than him. So I think right now people would like to see me go against somebody who's bigger than me. It's just uh, you know have a, a different challenge. Um, but you know him telling telling me to uh, beg him, it just it was kind of a douchey thing to do. And I felt like I was already in a situation where I had not very much to gain. Not many people would know who he is. So um, I just felt like he was being a douchebag, and I'm just like I'm not I'm not gonna even entertain you. So, John, la last question for me. Conor McGregor just won two belts in two divisions simultaneously. Yeah. W what do you think about his accomplishment? I think it's an amazing accomplishment. Um, I've always been a big fan of Conor McGregor. Um, you know, the guy has been able to do something that no one's been able to do. And, uh, you know, nothing but great things to say about him. I mean, it's great for our sport. Can't wait to see you back in the ring, sir. I can't wait to get back in. <laughs> Thank you.